on a scale of one to ten, how much does Mariah Carey loves you? <laughs> okay, I'm assuming you're saying ten. Ten, yeah. That, that means she'll do anything for you, right, Nick? Anything. You believe she'll do anything for you? Yeah, yeah. That's a lie, Nick. Because she loves you that much? Why had she sacrificed her music career by doing a feature with you? Mr. Nick Cannon, if I gave you $2 for every woman who you've ever been faithful to, oh. wait, 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 how would you spend that $0? Oh. I plead the fifth. Good evening, Mr. Cannon. What up, quick man? question for you. Very quick and painless. LL Cool J. Snoop Doggy Dog. <laughs> Nick Cannon. <laughs> Which of these rappers went negative platinum? <laughs> Take your time. Take your time. I plead defense. Thank you. That's one for the black team. They didn't ship enough albums. <laughs> Nick Cannon. Yes, Mr. It's Mayor. only one question we all want to know the answer to. <laughs> Do you even like your music? <laughs> <laughs> your album suck. <laughs> <laughs> Is it true your album sucked so much that you created headphones so someone would listen to it? There comes a time in a man's life where he just got to tell the truth. <laughs> Nick, you know I never wanted you to go through no divorce, but God damn it, it happened. But look, now that it is what it is, don't it feel good to not have to lie about smashing the wild and out girl? <laughs> Where did, what camera I'm on? This camera? Don't you lie, Nick. Hey, hey, Nick. Nick, I see you. I plead the fifth. <laughs> hey. Nick Ken, you know, we come to this courtroom to get the truth out of you. Yes. Okay, we want to know exactly what was going through your mind when you did this. Let me see it. What in the world? <laughs> like Eminem, but still be black. Is that why you got it blonde and kept the black spots? That, that ain't hot? No, is that hot? No! So I plead the fifth. There we go. <laughs> Listen, first of all, I just want to say, if I had one wish, that is one of my favorite songs, brother. <laughs> There's nothing like that. On a sunny day with a lovely lady, it's nothing like that. Uh, Nick? You don't have any songs I like, but anyway. <laughs> anyway, you do a lot of things, Mr. Nick Cannon. You do a lot of things. You're a rapper, you're an actor, you're a host, and also you're the manager of Wild and Out. You've managed to keep this show on for 10 years. Yeah. 10 years. <laughs> but I 
would like to know, Nick Cannon, is how come you never managed to get DJ d Rick another job? Answer the question, bro. Huh? Huh? I'm bleeding the fish. Nicholas King. <laughs> what up? We, we see him all on Instagram, you know, with matching Ferraris. He's managing her. Yeah, now. managing her. Yeah. But she's out of control. <laughs> we just want to know, you f Amber Rose or what, man? Absolutely not. Y'all don't believe me? This is the Bible. It ain't no damn Bible. <laughs> I'm a manager. That is a good point. She don't do nothing, Nick. <laughs> what are you managing? No, that's an even better question. What does Amber Rose do? <laughs> I breathe the fish. <laughs> Word to Papoose. <laughs> Look at your team, Nick. Guilty coming on this show with all these expensive diamonds and nice leather vests with the number of albums you've sold on there. <laughs> I look around at the cast, I see a bunch of t-shirts and sweatshirts. Not a lot going into the budget. So we were just wondering collectively as a team, how much you make an episode? The fit. <laughs> hey, Azalea, how you doing? You're such a beautiful. I love those boots. Those thank are beautiful. You, you want to know what I don't love? What? Nick's music. All right, let's move on. <laughs> Mr. Cannon, you create opportunities for people. For example, the Wild and Out Girls. Like, you give them an opportunity to be more than just objectified on Instagram and social media. You get it. You right. get it. So my question to you with that said, Mr. Cannon, is would you allow your daughter to be a Wild and Out Girl? <laughs> Nah. Hell. Oh, oh, hell no. Nah. Ladies, come here, come here, ladies. Uh, uh, well, with that being said, what is it that the Wild and Out girls do that you wouldn't want your daughter to do? <laughs> I'm pleased you fit. Exactly. <laughs> Nicholas Scott Kennedy. <laughs> <laughs> You've been famous a long time, uh -huh. and you know a lot of famous women. So I know you smashed a couple famous women. So out of all the famous women you smashed, which one do you miss the most? Oh. Hey, the camera right there, bro. Right there? I plead the fifth. dramatic and you know I jump over tables and I do things and I say things really? like a hoe and shit. but who's more dramatic me or your Mariah I don't know you and I ain't gonna talk bad about my baby mama on TV so, I plead the fifth y'all oh, don't gotta go home to uh, the other Mariah <laughs> I like how you been handling that. Real, real dudes do real things, all right? They don't wear ponytails. <laughs> they don't wear Captain America jackets either. OK. <laughs> real quick question, simple. You had sex with Chili after Usher. Ooh. <laughs> Why you playing, man? The dark, man. Go so ahead. Nick. Why, man? Question. You had sex with Chili. Why you got to repeat it? Cause you repeated it. <laughs> <laughs> I plead the fit. Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> he's handsome in person, right, ladies? Yeah. Not my type, he's light skinned. Okay. <laughs> so I'm trying to secure the bag for season 12. <laughs> okay. Do I have to give you a massage? <laughs> or give you this twerk work? Yeah. I bleed the fist. What's up, Nick? You good? What's happening, John John? Yeah, that's my name. That's my name. Uh, <laughs> if you had a trash can, right? Okay. Which one of these would you throw away? Okay. Your music career? Your movie career? Or her braids? Which one would you? <laughs> Damn. Why? Sweetheart, I think your braids are beautiful. Your Nubian brains. But I love my music and my movie, so I'ma plead the fifth. Yes! Let them talk about you like that. Your brains are beautiful. Hello, Nick Cannon. How do you do? I have a simple question for you. You own Incredible E&T, and you signed Justina and Charlie. Conceded hit man to that's your themes. So if in this courtroom you could choose only one of those artists to use to represent and make you a hit, well, tell us, Nick, which one would you pick? Who you running with? Which one you gonna pick, man? Well, freestyling, man, that is your gift. But I'm gonna tell you like this, I plead the fifth. <laughs> Nick Pop Shakur, what's going on with you, man? What's up, man? Just like my client, Soldier Boy, you also are from the hood. Southeast, to be exact. Southeast San Diego, you got a tight... Tatted on your, uh, she must be from there too. Uh, <laughs> uh, my question to you is, do you think that my client, Big Soldier, is capable of being from your hood? Yes. Okay, so what have you done to be a person that is capable of blessing people into a hood? Like, <laughs> what, what type of work have you put in in the hood? I'm a man of the community. I'm certified, man. I'm you talking about you? gangster stuff. <laughs> you have a, this is a gangster set. Gangsters. <laughs> I played the film. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What's up, Nick? <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, you give a lot of people opportunities out here, bro. You know what I mean? But the jury is still out on whether or not you're actually respectful to everybody. So, real quick, I've been here for two seasons. What's my full name? Brent Pella. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> He's been here since day one. What's his full name? Derek Batiste. Okay. Wow. Good job, Nick. Now, this cameraman has also been here <laughs> since day one. <laughs> what is his full name? <laughs> I believe the fit. <laughs> it's Ski. He's leaving. Ski, I love you. You're my favorite cameraman, though. <laughs> Hi, Nick. How are you doing? I'm good. Are you, are you happy that I'm your lawyer? I, I don't think you're my lawyer. <laughs> oh, are you happy that I'm his lawyer? Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm happy you're not my He's... lawyer. <laughs> yes, I'm the prosecutor. Um, you know what? F*** it, I'm the judge. Okay. I'm about to read you the verdict. Okay. The verdict is... Kibalt a five years in federal לא יודעים מה אתה הולך לעשות, יש מצב שאתה תקבל גזר דין מוות. How do you plead? One second, your honor. I know what she said. Get out of here. Hey, don't cheat, don't cheat. How do I plead? Apparently, you just pled in Hebrew, so I'm gonna say, I plead the fifth. I hate that you're in tax court, bro, but I'm trying to make sure you get right. So it says here uh, you dropped a song called Provider. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It was very catchy, very viral. And the lyrics are, uh, I'll pay your rent. Sing it. All you got to do is twerk. 
Ooh, boy, and you a man of your word. <laughs> so I just need you to tell the people real quick, just for tax purposes, uh, what's some of the Instagram names of the girls Wrench are currently paying right now? <laughs> I plead the fifth. What'd you say? I plead the fifth. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>